Hey there everyone, this is Trent here. I want to take a moment to give you a tour through the Sublime Text client side plugin I wrote. And it's really a copy of uh, the plugin I wrote for gedit. The main target of this program is just to minify format and do a CSLint and JSLint on your client side files, which is where it gets the client side name. Uh, from what I can tell, the plugin should work on Windows, Linux, and Mac. I currently use it on Mac and Linux primarily. And uh, I want to give you a quick tour of it. I've got open here a JavaScript file. And with the file open, just a couple of quick shortcuts. I can minify the file with the Alt minus. And if I want to format the file, I can do a Alt opening bracket. And it formats it nicely there. You can set your options. I'll show you in just a second how to do that. And if you just want to do a, a lint on the file, you can do an alt equals. And it opens it up in a new window. So if you want to know how to open them in new windows and uh, just replace the current text, or you can print it out to the console, just go to your preferences, package settings, client side, and go into your user settings there, and you'll find that your CS Minify, your JS Minify, and Format, and Lint. You can change all these to New, which will open in a new window. You can replace, or you can print it out to the console, and it'll just print each one. There's actually another one I haven't commented in there. It's called Clipboard, which will just put it on your clipboard. You can copy and paste it wherever you need it. Um, if you scroll down the settings here, you'll see I've, I've got a, a section for most every action in the plugin we can uh, add in our customized format settings our JavaScript settings uh, this is primarily the main configuration you're going to need to set if you plan to use any lint. Lint uses Node to execute its JavaScript and so you'll have to tell it how to execute a Node command. Uh, it's pretty much if you open up a terminal and type in which uh, node or which node.js it will tell you where it's at or what it uses uh, most systems it's going to be node or node.js but uh, that's only for the lint if you don't plan on using lint you don't even have to worry about setting that and then of course you can pass in all your custom js lint or cs lint options you want to pass through I know there's a lot of those but uh, that's pretty much it it's a simple quick plugin uh, you just you can run it through the wbond package manager and it should install right up and like I said should work on Windows, Linux and Mac. Hope you enjoy.